Oh, you've gotten yourself all clean. I just expressed his glands, his anal glands. They were really bad. Oh, Habibi, you look so beautiful. <laughs> Let's make sure it doesn't get too hot on him. That's why I think it's It's a little warm. Can we go low? It's okay. Wow. <laughs> Welcome back to the channel, and we are starting up another vlog. So, before we get started, I did want to mention a little bit, I have seen a lot of comments regarding Stella. Now, Stella did pass away late November. It's been a minute. And I posted about it on my, um, on my Instagram. Uh, where I know a lot of people that's been following me are already um, are already there because ultimately it's it's like a personal thing, like it, it's most affecting me. And I understood that there's people that really enjoy Stella from from years on the camera, but there's not really, I would say, an interpersonal relationship between anybody else and her. So I guess I was being a little selfish. If, if anything, and only thinking of how I was dealing with it all. So I guess I didn't understand maybe the gravity of how many people actually were, were touched by it. So for that, I do feel bad about it. And I do apologize to those people if you do feel like I blindsided you with the information. It was very difficult, but I don't, like I said, I don't like to focus on those types of things. And it has been a couple months now. The other piece of, of drama that I see, and I'm, I guess I'll sit down. I wasn't even planning on doing this, I wasn't. But I just thought might as well. The other piece of drama that I did know on the comments were in regards to basically why am I getting another dog whenever I couldn't handle the other one. But that was a multifaceted situation and that it so many think that it was just pee and poo that was a problem and it wasn't it was the temperament it was how the dog relayed and related to stella most importantly and ultimately i had reese for a month and he did have a family that he could go back to so that was a whole situation that I knew at the time. And so now whenever we talk about, you know, Habibi, also remember that this dog isn't technically mine and I did not pay for him. It was not my decision. I support Mark in it. And I told him, he asked me if I was ready for another dog here, if I would let a dog be here. And I said, well, I can't guarantee anything. I can't guarantee if I can become attached to him or, or if anything like that, but I won't stop you from having a dog here. I, that's fine. And, and to my surprise, I, he's talking to Google on there. To my surprise, I am, I am attached to Habibi tremendously. His temperament and everything is more in, in, a, more in line with, you know, with us both. Habibi does pee, he does poo. I don't care. Like, I really don't. Like, it's funny how so many people latched onto that one idea about pee and poo on rugs. As if like, that, like I just couldn't handle it. And it, no, it, it wasn't like that. Rugs are rugs. Like, it, it was so many things. It's so many little things about Reese that, that just didn't work. I, and, and, you, you, and you do not know until you try things. That's the biggest thing. And so many people think it's an all or nothing approach to like everything in life. And I, I just don't agree. I don't, especially on something like a dog where you, know, you can't force yourself to be a certain way. You can't force a situation to be better. That said, welcome to the vlog. <laughs> And we've got a full plate today. We're gonna to go out and do some things. I just thought that should be said about about the 
about the stuff. You know, and the other thing is so many people said, I, I just brushed it under the rug or what was the, what was uh, one as though I didn't even care. You were not with me and Mark in the room whenever that decision was made. You were not. And there's a reason for that. It's not, it, it's not a public thing. It's not something that I like to put out there and it's no, it's nothing to monetize or talk about. But here I am because it was brought up in so many ways and it attacks my character really. And what character are you attacking? A falsity? One that you're creating in your mind? Most likely, yes. But it's my fault and maybe again, not being as forthright as I could, but I want to reserve certain things for myself. And that's tricky with a business like this when you show some things and you don't show other things. But I try and want to focus more on the good things going on and less about the negative things, even though they may be affecting me internally. You're so cute. Habibi, are you ready? This was a very long intro, Mark. I know. You I came, you. you walked in on it. Mm -hmm. I was just finishing my shower. Mm. What do you think about all the stuff? I don't know. Yeah. <laughs> you, don't, you don't owe explanation to everyone. Just... Here is the new desk. I'm so pleased with it. So I'm going to try to do more of my editing over here. And also we have, this is actually Mark's, he brought it, the new headband, or headband, what is this called? Earphone, head, headphones. So that's really cool to edit with, especially when he's sleeping. Uh, and plus, I can hear the audio that much more better. Mm -hmm. And yeah, so this is a great like little editing area for me. I'm very Wait for me too. Oh yeah. yes. Well, because Mark does want to, you know, start editing and try to try to get into. He has like vlogs that he does when he travels. Um, like he has a Canada vlog when he went there and visited his family. So he's trying to deal with that. We got to go to the post office today too. Yikes. Yikes. Habibi's tasting. That's the one where we brought him. <laughs> yeah. There's like... Welcome back to the channel. And today we are here at another estate sale. In Central I don't know Florida, if... And I am so excited to go to... By the way, go check out my reselling video. <laughs> so we're gonna um, try... There's one like where we're holding him there. He's so cute. Habibi. Habibi. <laughs> oh, 13. Oh, I'm here seeing him as a baby. His name is Habibi. Habibi, are you ready? I think so. Oh, you look so adorable and clean. It is a really beautiful day. It's supposed to be like 82 degrees, and it's currently, I think, 70. That's just so nice and remarkable. And gas is currently $3.19. That's great. Oh, look at all the little dogs. Oh my gosh. Okay. Some people are like, I don't want to see the needle. <laughs> so efficient. We're heading into home goods now so we can find a curtain. Mark needs a blackout curtain so that he could sleep well. Okay, so what is the dimensions? 130, 90. 130 and then 90 tall. Okay. So, well, they've got 84. There's 108. That's a block out. This is not a block out. Oh, yeah. I like a, a more of like a, a white version. Well, we came here the other day and I was looking at like, I like this because it has the gold in there, but that's not blackout. Do you remember the one that we saw? Mm -hmm. It was somewhere over here. They have some really cool. Was it this? This is a blackout. That's beautiful. Look, there's like little bits of silver in there. We could do that. I like the black because it's transition to your white. Yeah. How much they're contrasting to it. Mm -hmm. I don't know if we're gonna get the curtains here. They're very expensive. One set would be $70 and we need two sets. So that's like $140 for blackout curtains. I think what we're going to do is just go to Walmart and get them there because it's really not important or super important that it's like a high quality situation. So we are put, we put the rod back and we'll just go to Walmart. Mark spotted these uh, syrups and I've never had one, but it's sugar free. Um, look at this thin cinnamon vanilla. That sounds cool. And then the one you found was the 
I don't, I don't think I tried the salted you caramel, wanted? something like that. I thought you wanted to do the. You want? It's already like the brush of vanilla, like there. So like. I know. I thought you wanted to do a caramel macchiato. Yeah, I thought it's not. Yeah, and five dollars, baby. How would you like some? <laughs> He's so good. Okay, we are headed into the hair salon for Mark, and hopefully they can do something fun for him, like a fade or something. Oh my gosh, look at this big dog. It is so huge. Benji, that's his name. Wow. Look at that fade. <laughs> You're a Burmy do it all. You're a huge Burmy do it all. Benji. Benji. Yeah, he. Oh, yeah. I think he would fall over. He's very scared. My, our dog is very scared, yeah. He would go hide in a corner somewhere. I think it looks amazing. You are ready to go. Yeah. Oh, you didn't lie your car. Oh, shoot. I forget to lock this thing all the time. We're going for food now. Here we are at Edo Japanese Steakhouse. I need to lock my car while I'm thinking about it. This they brought out the miso soup. This looks really nice. Has some crushed or some onions in it. Let's see what we think here. It's either soup or a salad. So I was like, well, salad you can get anytime you like. That's good. I think so. I think I've had miso soup before and I do like it. Looks good. I do like it. It's good. It's pretty salty, but I do like it. <laughs> Here we go. So this is sumai, is that correct? And you have this in the Philippines as well? Okay, so what's it exactly? It's in um, shrimp inside. Shrimp? And it's like, it's, like a, it's like a wrapper. Oh, okay, it's inside of there. Yeah, so inside of it is like... A little shrimp waiting for us? Mm -hmm. I think it's shredded chicken. I chicken and shredded, up. oh, shredded up. Oh, they could have left it whole for me. That's okay though. Oh, it feels like a dumpling or something. It's like very, um, what is it, soy sauce? Yeah, it looks like soy sauce. I shouldn't have done that. Let's see here, what do we think? Well, I like it's just soy sauce. I shouldn't have dumped, dipped it. It tastes, I can taste the shrimp, barely. Hmm? You can that? Barely. I should just try it by itself because it's that's taking over everything. Let's see here. It's very good. Yeah. Mm. Ours are the same, except mine's little noodles and yours are big worm looking noodles. Mm -hmm. Wow. Yeah, that was a very good appetizer. Oh, so good. This was a very good. So we each have some to take home for either later or tomorrow. All right, we are here at Walmart now, looking for a curtain rod. Yeah, the f I, what did you think about the food overall? Mm, had better, I uh, like, feel the Thai food that we have. The Thai, the Royal Orchid? Yeah. 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 We'll go into home and pharmacy, I guess. Yeah. We, we, we're gonna probably come out with the whole cart full, like normally. We go in for three things and come out with the cart. That's just life. Last time we were here, it didn't work. So let's see if it does. If so, then we'll both, we'll both do it. Here we go. Blood pressure time. I want to do mine next. Okay, sure. We'll see whose blood pressure is the highest. Of course, the new. Oh, really? Whoever's the highest wins. Why is that woman talking so much? She's very happy. Oh, is this good? Oh, hi. Yeah. It's okay, we're all seven, eight. Let's see here how much you have. What do you think it's going to be? Same, same thing with me, I guess. Same as you? Right. I don't know, we'll see. I don't know. Let's see here, I'm so excited. Yes, I am. No test. Oh my god, yeah, it's elevated. Oh no. It's so scary. Oh, oh no, I'm elevated. We found these. The, whole, the trick was trying to find enough of them in a, a color that we liked in the length and everything. So this is 84 inch, it's a blackout. It's like a cream, cream, like a cream color. 
So now we just need to find a pull. These were like $15 each, each which is amazing. That's $60. That's just like so well. And the one that was in Hong Kong. It would have been like, it would have been like double yeah. or at least. No, one piece of one leg. One, I know one was 60. Oh, yikes. That's nuts. Well, our cart is coming together. <laughs> hey, this is all stuff that we needed. I decided to get these for my, there's like a wooden chair. It's an antique Chinese one. The brown I chose because it'll blend in with the chair itself being brown. So it's not going to like stand out and it'll blend in with you. <laughs> um, and we got a wrench because I need to tighten my shower thing. And that's, we need a big one. A uh, new cutting board, so those are beautiful. And then a pitcher, pitch, pitcher, I'm saying in Filipino way, <laughs> pitcher, <laughs> and a pitcher so that we can make uh, iced, tea. iced tea. Yeah. I think a BB needs a stuffed animal. A Which one? one? An octopus. Something. I don't know. Like I want something like brown. A sloth. They have all these pink flamingos, but their hair is like <laughs> disgusting. <laughs> it's really, really gross looking. <laughs> what is this? Oh, this, that one. I don't see very good options here. What about those huge ones over there? Those are, the, those are more. It's already big for a baby. Oh, we can get him a bear that says Happy Valentine's Day. No. Oh, <gasps> look at the one up top that's $10 with all the little roses for the body. We were looking at harnesses here. And that one, that one looks nice. It looks pro professional. The other dogs will be so jealous. Yeah, maybe. And then also we're looking at maybe this ball. He doesn't have a proper ball. And then that way we can roll it and then he can go chase it because he does like to run and bring things back. So this ball. Oh, yeah. I don't think you're going to get much of a better deal online anyway, to be honest. And plus you can see the quality. It's okay. It's doing its job. Oh, a donut. Oh. He can be our little donut. Stella was a potato. That's so cute. <laughs> I like this donut. You can buy him. You buy him the donut. You'll buy the for It's him? so cute. Yeah. Are you sure? Yeah, of course. He's my little Habibi. So I drove 15 minutes out of the way just so I could come here to Peach Wave. I don't think I've ever been to one, but it's very similar to the frozen yogurt that we have at the racetrack gas station sometimes. But I assume that this might be better. So I'm excited for it. Okay, so we get to choose a cup. What's the difference? They've got, oh, I see they're different sizes. Well, I'm all about getting the most I can get in life. So this one looks like they've got orange, a Euro tart, strawberry, pineapple, Arctic peppermint party, or no, patty. <laughs> An Arctic peppermint patty. Vanilla, gelato, gelato. Mm. Oh, they're out of two of them? Oh no, what's this? Is that cinnamon roll? Salted caramel. Caramel. Salted caramel. Oh my gosh, I could not speak. Mine definitely does not look as nice as Mark's. He put a lot of fun and, and colors in his. I already had a brownie, and then there's these like really, these are really good. They're like cheesecake. But I should have definitely got the sample sizes and tried them before I filled up my thing because I put coconut in here and I don't even know if I like the coconut, but hopefully I do. All right, I am back. What are you doing? <laughs> oh, Mark's over there. Uh, so this morning I actually went estate sale shopping and I'm back and it's 11.30. With that, I will wrap this video up, this vlog. And don't forget to like, comment, and subscribe. Bye-bye.